What's good, Biggie's baby fam? Indeed, I'm very glad to have each and every one of you on here. Yeah, how was your day? And I trust that your day was beautiful. And if it was, even if it wasn't, like I'll always say, don't worry, there's always hope for tomorrow. Before we dive into what we have for this clip, I want to like thank a few of our commenters who have been doing so well and supporting us. First, we have BRS, yeah, our dear BRS, um, Katie Cox, all of you guys are so dear to me, Kadiatu Kamara, Nonton Bivena, Oja Nancy, Ubon Mag Agoa, Lesogo Komadaira, I hope I got the pronunciation well, Ola Joke Dada. You all have been super amazing and if you didn't hear your name, don't worry on the next, I would give a shout out to you. Now, on to what we have for today. Indeed, Liquor Rose and Emmanuel are doing us, you know, are making us proud. I wanted to say doing us good, they are making us so proud, fam. I don't know, I'm always happy to, you know, share good news about these guys. They have done so well for themselves. Some of you would know that they are so big on Instagram. These guys, Emmanuel is close to a million followers right now. Liquor is over 2 million followers and you see, the other time she celebrated, you know, the huge achievement she had reached two million fans on instagram and same for emmanuel i don't know his exact amount i'm sorry that's very wrong of me though i should but i know he's doing very well he's near to a million above that actually but their twitter accounts they didn't have that kind of followership mainly because you know um of the ban on twitter that was placed by the nigerian government yeah from some of you outside nigeria you may not you know have heard of this but yeah the nigerian government placed a restriction on Twitter usage in Nigeria for like say six months or for like eight months there about only like a few weeks ago did they release the ban hence it really you know play took its toll on some of the people in Nigeria housemates especially I have two favorites Emmanuel and Lee Coros because they didn't, they didn't have the accelerated growth that usually comes with being on the people in Nigeria show and besides you know Twitter is one of the in fact Twitter is the biggest means that people discuss the issues of people in Nigeria but this time around you know the band really didn't didn't do good to the show but any which ways i'm so happy that Imona and the chorus you know still blew the restrictions notwithstanding and that shows that they're children of grace so what am i heading to very recently the chorus celebrated 70,000 subscribers on twitter fam you guys know that <laughs> Having 70,000 people on Twitter is a very big deal. In fact, in my opinion, it's easier to have, if it's easier to grow your fan base on Instagram than on Twitter. If you're doing anything on Twitter and you're successful and have that kind of followership, that means it's intentional. That means those people literally have to search for you. On like Instagram that could like suggest people to you and all of that. I know Twitter does that, but the algorithm on Twitter doesn't really favor people the way Instagram does. I am telling you. But well, Likoros has managed to grow and within a space of a couple of weeks after her fans began announcing her as we began asking the fans from Instagram to you know help grow her Twitter page, her Twitter handle and help you know push it. She has reached 70,000 fans and she just put like a GI of a baby dancing and that was so cute though. That thing has had over 9,000 views right now. Indeed Likoros is a very big deal. She's a big fish. Trust me. In Nigeria, we usually call men the Odogu, but I love to call the chorus an Odogu because she's doing stuff that men also do. That girl has really hit it big in the Nigerian entertainment industry, and I'm very happy for her. And even more, I am so excited to announce to you that Emmanuel has also joined the league. Barely 24 hours after the chorus announced her as men, these guys, their back to back celebrations is something that gives me joy, you know. And it's happening at around the same time. So, this guy, in my opinion, I feel that they complement themselves spiritually and physically. I don't know how. I'm not a spiritist or anything. I don't hear. Yeah. But any which is, I feel this. And you know what? Money talked about it. When he said, he told Imano that in the Big Brother, in the Big Brother house, that see, you have won so many things after your friendship with Likoro. See, this thing it is spiritual. You know, White Money believes in the spiritual, all of that. I believe it actually, but White Money really expounded on it. And we are beginning to see it. These guys complement each other so much. And you've seen that they grow hand in hand. I don't know how that happens, but any which ways, we know that each of them carry their own grace and they are pushing themselves forward. Now, yesterday, Likoros celebrated 70,000 fans and today, Emmanuel celebrated 60,000 fans, just the 10,000 difference. These guys are really twinning in my opinion and I'm so proud of them. And you know, one thing that comes with Twitter and uh, Twitter followership is that your your, your personality, your brand is, in, is exposed to people that really want to work with you. Twitter was 
and still is a very huge market social media market in nigeria in my opinion before the twitter ban there were thousands of people that were advertising on twitter yes but you know once the ban took place the ban was placed rather a lot of people switched to instagram yeah instagram has always been a good place to advertise and you know money and liquors are still are big on instagram influencing i mean massive on instagram influencing however before then nigerians were very 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 big too on twitter so i believe it's it's a, a new door has been opened for them yes they advertise their brands and all of that but it's taking a bigger turn because when companies see that at least you're up to a hundred thousand or above you know a certain amount they take you more seriously and they tend to pay you more and your management is seen as serious because they're able to push you and push you to a certain level i'm telling you this thing it's it's, it's a foot of confidence in my opinion when people search for you and want to follow you on that on that on that on that platform talking about twitter then you're doing good then indeed there's something you're doing that's impacting their lives and i'm so proud of this too they really know what they want out of life and and they are going for it and even more you know it looks like a small fit there are some housemates i'm talking about the different past set who didn't used to celebrate until who didn't celebrate their twitter pro- progress until they hit like hundred thousand fans i'm telling you two hundred thousand five hundred thousand but these people they know how to celebrate their small wins and that is one thing about these people they celebrate small wins small wins those things that you know seem not to be very important and this is what matters to the fans the fans want to see them grateful that they're grateful for the fact that they are that they are progressing and in my opinion if i am if i am if as as i'm looking at these people i am i mean for the long haul with these guys i am telling you and i believe many of you too are because they're not just down to earth they also celebrate the simple things that commoners or let people in quote you know there's no such thing i don't believe in commoners but people of everyday people in quote you know celebrate they also celebrate these people don't want to they don't want to create that chasm like that different don't you don't even want their fans to know that oh i am the celebrity and you are the fan they make the fans know that oh this is my everyday life and that is why i love them i am telling you on our own of our clips we'll talk about it Immanuel and Nicholas have done way more than they are they're putting out on the internet i am telling you the truth but yet they are so humble and level-headed and i'm so proud of them they just know how to make us happy by you know putting out these things and then we celebrate with them and we hashtag them and they trend more I am telling you, these guys are trending off of us. They are trending off of our happiness. And I'm so happy that they are doing this because they are making themselves more marketable. This is Still Biggie's Baby TV. And I'm glad to have you guys on here. We will still be doing a lot of commenter shout outs. I am really grateful to you guys. You guys have been showing us love and showing the Licoros and Emaro's brand love. And please don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, and turn on your post notification bell. And we're on our way to. 10,000 subscribers. I urge you guys to help us like this video. The more you like this video, it takes less than a millisecond to do that. It takes less than a millisecond to do that. Liking this video simply sh- tells YouTube that you want more Imaros fans to see this. That is how that's called YouTube algorithm. And then he shares it and recommends us to people who like Imaros and who believe in them. Even fam, please don't skip the ads. Uh, that's one way you can also support us. God bless you, fam, and peace out.